the tools that you are using matter. Okay, who realizes that? The, who realizes there are tools out there that can put me in chat? Two panelists and attendees, by the way, put me in chat. If you realize that tools, software, dialers, phones, all that kind of stuff can make your life easier when you are helping yourself get in front of people, actually working the phone harder to where you can call literally someone every every few minutes. And you can get through 60 dials an hour instead of manually dialing and maybe getting to like 15. Okay. I mean, software is absolutely a huge piece of what we do. That's right. That's right. That's right. I love tools. I do too. I'm realizing how important tools are and what we do. Like our team is on a dialer every single day, right? Like you want to make life easier. Trust me. The individuals, the individuals that I know that are doing millions by phone, they have some of these tools and software and some of these, some of these other things rolling, okay? So we have came out with, okay, I'm gonna stop the share because I don't need to share the, the computer sound anymore, okay? I'm, we have finally, it's about time, finally came out with a custom, drum roll please, okay, drum roll, come on now. Okay, drum roll please, we've just, we finally, I got a huge surprise. I'm so excited for the surprise. Okay. It's been, it's been a lifelong dream to do this. We've been, I've been talking about doing this for five years, by the way, five years and like four months. We're talking about doing this. I'm super excited to finally release it and talk about it and physically show you a buddy, Mr. Matt up there is actually going to be doing that for me. We finally decided to come out with a C a dialer to a custom built CA dialer to help you be better at getting in front of people, whether it's setting appointments or selling over the phone. Okay, is that good or is that good? Give me some fire in chat. If you're like, holy freak, that is huge. I'm excited, okay? Because what, what I've learned is there's a lot of dialers out there. There's a lot of options out there. There's a lot of things that you can do, okay? I just know that this one has to be better than whatever you're using and better than anything else on the market. Because trust me, I have scoured the market. I've looked to actually help you with a dialer. I now know what the best option on planet Earth is for an insurance agent to use software and tools to make your job easier. And that is the CA dialer. Okay, so I'm going to have my good buddy Matt uh, actually jump on with me for a second. I'm going to have him actually walk through and show it around. Okay. This dude knows this thing inside and out. Um, let me actually add a spotlight. Boom, there we are. What's up, Cody? How are you, sir? I'm doing awesome. Happy to be on here. I, I love it, man. So, so, so I'm excited to introduce you guys to my good buddy, Matt. Uh, when it comes to software, tools, dialers, he's been an integral piece of the CA dialer coming together. Um, unbelievable dude. Uh, if you haven't got a chance to get to, get to get to know Matt, you're about to. Okay, dude, I'm so excited for the launch of CA Dialer. Oh, man, we've been working hard for this day. So I I am so excited about this. Yeah, it's huge, man. Thank you for, for, for all the hard work and all the help and all the guidance, because I know that you've also been looking at the market <clears throat> on what's available. And, and I'm excited for you to ba we're about to get behind the scenes on what's actually really available um, and, and why what Matt's going to show you and talk to you about is that much better, okay? Um, well, I, I'll, I'll throw it to you, okay? I'll, re I'll, I'll remove me as a spotlight. I'll turn it over to you. Thank you for being here, okay? Appreciate the friendship. I'm learning a ton from this dude. Take some notes. Pay attention. Trust me. You want to be on the CA dialer. Thank you, Matt. Yeah. Now, just a quick little background on me. Um, I've been in the insurance business for about eight years. Uh, my twin brother and I have a pretty large organization. We've got about 250 agents that write business every month. Uh, we're just killing it right now. Uh, this month, will, it's obviously definitely a, a record-breaking month for us, but I think we're on track to do about $2 million in annual premium this month. Um, a lot of the Agencies in our, our group are probably people that you guys have probably heard of, like Nate Offer, Marlon Faulkner, uh, Jeremy Whitaker. So some of some of the best in the industry. We're very fortunate and blessed to uh, be a part of our organization. So, you know, we we've been uh, just like Cody said. We recognize that 
professionals always use tools. And I'm not talking about just professionals in the insurance industry. I'm talking about any professional. If you think about any industry out there, one of the, the, the two biggest differentiators between professionals, and amateurs is the knowledge that they have, which is why doing stuff like this with Cody is so, so awesome is you can go from being an amateur or, or a beginner or someone who's maybe not getting the results that you want to becoming a professional because you're getting the knowledge. But the other differentiator is the tools. And so, you know, I first, uh, it was funny, my brother, we were starting to, to, uh, to work on this dialer and, uh, you know, he had just bought a new house and he wanted to fence in his backyard. He had about an acre, acre and a half backyard. And he thought, oh, I'm going to, I'm going to, it can't be that hard to, to build a, a fence. So he went to Lowe's and he ordered the wood. And when this semi truck came to deliver this wood, it was so much wood and he had about a hundred post holes that he had to dig and all he had was a post hole digger a man if you have you ever used those manual post hole diggers you got to slam it in the ground pull it open put the dirt aside keep doing that because he didn't know of anything else that's all he'd ever known was this manual post hole digger so about 30 minutes in he's just dripping in sweat his shoulders are burning he's only dug about six inches deep and he's thinking, it's going to take me all summer just to dig the holes, let alone put this fence together. Well, about a, a half mile down the street, his father-in-law is a farmer. He's got all kinds of tractors and different equipment. And he owns hundreds of acres and hundreds of head of, head of cattle. And, and he happened to be driving by and seeing Brad struggle. And so he came by and he has this tractor with what's called a, an auger on the back. It's about a, a foot wide. It's about three or four feet tall. And he came and he, he dug a hole in about 30 seconds. And he went down and he had the whole entire yard done in, in about 30 minutes. And that's when Brad realized that he was an amateur and that professionals will use tools. And so the same goes for the insurance business. And so, you know, one of the things that I hated when I was in the, in, in the field, the thing I hated the, the most, the absolute most was dialing the phones. I hated dialing the phones. But where's the money made in this business? It's always made on the phones. Whenever I am coaching or talking to an agent and they're not getting the results that they want, you can almost always come down to the fact that they're just not putting in enough activity on the phone. And, and Cody, by the way, feel free to jump in at any point during this. So if you have anything you want to say, feel free to, to jump in. But um, and, and you may see this too, Cody, is that the people, a lot of times agents just aren't spending enough time on the phone. They're not calling enough. They're not getting enough. In, they're not getting in front of people enough. And so we thought, well, okay, how could we help our agents increase their activity, increase their productivity, increase their efficiency, and also hopefully help improve the worst part of the business for most people. And that's the phones. And so we started looking at different dialers out there, just like Cody did. We started looking at different dialers and we found that number one, they were really expensive and, and probably too, too expensive for most agents, especially newer agents to afford. And number two, they were really complicated because they were, they were not built for our industry. They were not built and created for an independent insurance agent. They were, they were created for like a call center. And it took a very tech savvy person to set it up and to use it properly. And so that wasn't a scalable, duplicatable way to do it. And so we started working on this dialer and, and partnered up with Cody on this. And we've had, uh, we, we started off, as soon as we, as soon as we uh, you know, finished this dialer, we, we had 40 agents test it. And these weren't new agents, these were experienced agents. I wanted to see what results do we get when an average or, or you know, average experienced agent is using the dialer compared to the ones that aren't. And so we had 40 of them that weren't using a dialer before. They were using like a cell phone or just doing it the old fashioned way. And the average agent, we, we, we looked at three months before using it, three months after using it. And the average agent had a 30% increase in sales. 30%. Wow. So whether that's you, go ahead, Cody. I said, wow, that's freaking crazy. Yeah, it's unbelievable. And what also happened is their calling hours on average were cut in half, cut in half. So you take the worst activity, the worst thing about this business and they cut it in half, but they had a 30% increase in sales. 
And so I'm not going to spend a ton of time going through the nitty gritty details because we've got an onboarding training where they'll spend 90 minutes going through how to set up the dialer, how to, how to use the dialer most effectively. So I'm just going to spend maybe in the next 10, 15 minutes going over some of the highlights and some of the differences in this dialer and other dialers out there, because there's, there was things that we wanted to have in this dialer that are really unique to insurance and really helpful in insurance that just did not exist out there. And so I'm going to spend some of that time going over those items. I'm going to bring a couple people on, a couple agents on that are using the dialer. And these aren't your average agents. These are the cream of the crop top agents in the industry uh, that have been using the dialer. And you're going to get to hear from them as well. So Cody, anything you want to say before I jump in? <coughs> well, I'm just excited about the uh, uh, potential, uh, the possibilities. 30% increase in sales is incredible and getting to cut the time in half is huge, man. So I'm excited to, uh, get down and show them. And then, yes, like you mentioned, I'm excited after you guys see this and everyone uh, make sure that you, that you sign up for the free trial. Once we get to that point, um, there will be time for you to actually get some um, onboarding training so that you can make sure you understand it. That you're really leveraging because that's what I, what, that's what, that's what's so cool with me is most people, I'm not very, I'm not that tech savvy. I'm, I'm no Matt Smith, you know, I'm not that tech savvy. Most people, uh, they sign up for something they just don't use it. Why? Because they don't understand how to use it or it gets too overwhelming. So I'm excited that we're going to have a whole team to help with that. So that's, that, that's a big benefit. Thank you, sir. Yeah, absolutely. Okay. So this is what the dialer screen actually looks like. So when you're calling your leads uh, and, and uploading your leads is really easy. Uh, we've got videos that will walk you through how to do that, but it's basically a, a CSV file or an Excel file. You just upload your leads and they're, they're in here. And so you got your contact information for the client up here in the left, any of the fields that you're going to be trying to collect information for. So, you know, we have a lot of people that do mortgage protection or final expense or term, you know, health insurance, PNC, whatever it is that you do. We have um, the fields that are customized for those different uh, verticals. But I'm, in this example, I'm just, we're talking about mortgage protection, final expense. And so the fields that you would, or the information you want to collect on the phone to set your appointment is going to be right here. Some of this information you may already have in the lead. So it's going to show there. And then anything else you'd, you'd filled in um, at your discretion while you're scheduling that appointment. And so the script is over here on the left and it's customized for that client. So you'll notice when you say, hello, Benny, it's actually pulling in Benny's name. I'm calling, you know, this is Matt, it's my name. I'm calling you about your mortgage in the amount of 180,000. That's, that's the amount that was on his lead with Bank of America. And so, you know, think about if you're building an agency and I saw a lot of people say, I wanna build an agency, I wanna build an agency. When it comes to building an agency, you've gotta have something that's duplicatable and scalable. And a lot of the, the challenge is the onboarding and the training. And so if you can plug a new person in and immediately they've got everything they need right in front of them. They got the script. They don't have to, to go back and forth between their lead and their script and their you know, client qualification form and all these different things in front of them that could be overwhelming. They can simply focus on the script. And as they get to parts where they're collecting information or verifying information, everything is right there. Um, and, and what's cool about the CA dialer specifically is Cody and his team have come in here and they have put their best scripts. They've put their best rebuttals to different objections. So some people say, well, how do you cover an objection for this? Or what if they say I'm not interested? Or what if they say I already talked to somebody, I already took care of it? And a lot of people don't know what to say. And maybe you do, but maybe you're recruiting agents that they, they don't know that yet. And so if they click on an objection, it's automatically going to update with the rebuttal. And so Cody's team has gone in here. He's got the best rebuttals from the best agents in the industry and how they cover these certain objections. Now you can always add more. So he's got his in here, but if you want to add more, you can do that. And so what's also happening here is it's also tagging this person as having given that objection. So imagine being able to, to run a report on your agents or your agency and see, okay, how often is this agent getting the not interested objection? Maybe there's some things that I can coach them to say or not say to avoid that objection from coming up. And so, um, so that's pretty cool. Uh, we've got two different dialing modes. There's click to call, and there's also a power dial mode. 
And so everything is browser-based. You don't need any downloads. You don't need any installs. You literally log in and you're ready to go. So you can click the call or I can do a power dial. Um, and you'll learn more about what that is in the onboarding. I can drop emails at the click of a button. I can drop text messages at the click of a button, pre-templated texts that are customized for that, that client. I can, I can drop a ringless voicemail. So if I want to record, you know, we do, we teach people a lot on door knocking. So, or not door knock, it's a, well, it is door knocking, but the way we do it is we set a warm, um, it's, a, it's an appointment, a preset appointment for people that you never talk to. So let me give you an example. So let's say you're calling somebody, you've called them 20 times and they're just not answering the phone. They will not answer the phone. And we always teach people to get resolution on every single lead. I want a yes or a no. I don't want a stack of maybes or people I've never gotten a hold of. I want resolution on every single lead. So if you can't get a hold of somebody, you can drop a ringless voice. And you basically, it would basically say, hey, this is Matt from the Mortgage Protection Group. I've been trying to get a hold of you for a while about a really important matter with your mortgage and um, haven't been able to do that. So I'm going to go ahead and stop by your house tomorrow. I'll be in your area tomorrow meeting with some of their clients and we'll go ahead and take care of that. Then I'll be there Sunday between 5 and 9 p.m. And so I might record that voicemail and let them know I'm going to be there tomorrow. And chances are either A, they're going to call you back or B, you're going to get there and they're going to be ready for you as if it's an appointment. So if you, if you guys were part of the... Um, you know, Jeremy Whitaker has been on a lot, a lot of training stuff. I know, I know, uh, Cody, you work with Jeremy Whitaker and he's one of our agents last year. He was, uh, one of the top agents in our company wrote over $500,000 of personal production. And if you asked him about door knocking, he would say about a third of my sales came from door knocking a third of them. So those are a third of the people that he could not get a hold of. He dropped a ringless voicemail, let him know I'm going to be in your area tomorrow. And he showed up and sold him a policy. And so that's the kind of thing you can do. But so the, so when we were designing this, we, we built in these features, but I said, man, wouldn't it be cool if we could actually tie a lot of this, this automation right into the disposition button? Because after you're done with the call, in order to move on to the next lead, I've got to say, what happened? Did I not talk to them? Are they not interested? Am I scheduling an appointment? What happened on that call? What if I could tie in a bunch of actions, you know, let's say email the client, text the client, email me the information, um, leave a ringless voice. Let's say I have no contact and I want to leave a voicemail. I want to leave a, an email, a text message. I want to do all these things all at the same time. And so what we did is we allow people to completely customize what happens when they click these buttons? So you could literally trigger 10 different things by the click of a button. You can even send a Zapier to a third-party application if you want to update a CRM or you want to, you know, whatever you want, whatever you can imagine, you can pretty much do with these custom dispositions. And so, you know, you've got your call queue, you've got the ability to have several different uh, caller IDs. So one thing that we did uh, when we were, you know, doing doing research in the in the industry and the dialers and stuff like that, is we found out that about you get about a four hundred percent increase in your answer rate if you call people from a local number. So if you're calling a four two three number and you've got a four two three area code, statistically you've got four times the chance of that person answering the phone. So now, how many of you guys put in the chat? How many of you guys? Um, are running appointments virtually or in other states or via Zoom or would like to do that? Put that in the, in the chat. Because if you're calling people in, an, in another state, if you're calling people from another area code, a lot of times you might feel like you're just spinning your wheels. You're not getting people to answer the phone. And if you had a local number, you'd have about four times the chance. So, you, so with the dialer, you can get as many numbers as you want, as many area codes as you want. And we've got what's called smart local ID. And this is really cool. So what that's going to do is every time I call somebody, it's going to match up my caller ID to match theirs. So if I have a 423, it'll automatically put that in there. If, if I call someone with an 847 area code and I've got an 847, it'll automatically use that one. And if they call you back, you can set it to ring to a cell phone or whatever number you want it to come into. Um, so that's going to really help get more people to answer the phone. I've also got um, the ability to, to apply filters. So let's say you're calling a certain state and you just wanna focus on that state, or maybe you're calling a certain type of lead. 
So you're calling final expense or you're calling Medicare or whatever, and you want to just focus on that lead type, you can create these um, filters to be able to do that. So if I want to just focus on, you know, Green County, then I can just, just call my Green County leads. And so I, when I was in the field, I worked about seven different counties and there's no way you can work seven counties in a day. So I would have to do two counties a day. And I would, I, so I, in, in this situation, I would have created a filter for the two counties I was, I was working that day. So another thing that, that uh, I used to hate is when you're working a, a large geographic area, you don't really know who's going to book the appointment and you don't know where they're going to be located. Like I, I might be focusing on a specific county or, or a couple counties, but I don't know how counties are where you guys are at, but two counties, it could take me an hour, hour and a half to get from one appointment to another. And I used to try to sort my leads and say, okay, I'm going to call people from this city first and this city. But again, you don't know who's going to answer the phone. You don't know who's going to book their appointment. And so what we did is we integrated Google Calendar with Google Maps. And so what this is going to do is it's looking up the address of the person I have on the phone. I've, I'm on the phone with George Gunter and I've already set some appointments and it's going to tell me the appointments that are close to George. So I've got this set up to, to highlight in green any appointments that are within 15 miles. You could set that to be whatever you want. You could do five miles, you could do 10 miles. And so I already know I'm going to be in this guy's area Saturday at one. And I'm going to, so I'm going to go for a, a, a Saturday two o'clock appointment or a Friday at six. Okay. And if I mouse over the appointment, it's actually going to tell me the exact distance and the exact travel time to get there. So this guy, he's 14.89 miles. It's going to take me 25 minutes with traffic to get there. So wouldn't it be nice if I knew that and I could leave a 30 minute drive time. This guy, is, he's 12 minutes away. This one's 13 minutes away. This one's 17 minutes away. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to book them right here. I'm going to save it. And, when, and what that's going to do is it's going to email the client a confirmation appointment. It's going to actually include the calendar link so that it goes into the client's calendar and can remind them. I've got it set to email me all the information. So here's a, an appointment confirmation. It's actually going to send the client this email. I can put the date and time. I can put whatever you want in this email confirmation. And then I'm going to, I'm going to get as the agent, all the information I just collected, all the information I just collected is going to be in my email. All I have to do now is print that off and take it with me to the appointment. And then what's going to happen is it's going to go right into my calendar and it's going to put all the information I just collected right into my calendar. So if I wanted to, all I have to go with is my cell phone or maybe an iPad. And I just go through my appointments. I pick them up. Everything the client told me is right there in my calendar. I've got the address right there. If I'm going from a point to home, I just click on the address and I'm there. I've got their phone number. I've got everything right there at my fingertip. If it's a virtual appointment, it's integrated with Zoom. And so, or, or really any, any uh, web, webinar service, if it's you know, any, any other besides Zoom, you can do that as well, but it's going to put the Zoom link right there. It's also going to email that link to the client. I've got it set up to email a reminder, text a reminder. I can even send a ringless voicemail as a reminder. And a lot of times when you're doing Zoom, you want as many reminders as you possibly can to get that person to show up. So you could send an email, you could send a text and you could drop a ringless voicemail and say, Hey, I look forward to, to meet with you in about 30 minutes. I'll see you soon. And so you're going to get a lot more people showing up to the appointments because of that. So, um, Cody, I'm not sure how much time we have left. I can spend a little bit more time going through this or we can, uh, to jump to testimonials or, um, let me know. Go ahead, Matt, go, go ahead. And if there's anything else that, you know, we really want to, uh, show them that will help them, they'll help them be more, be more successful, go ahead. And then we can jump into testimonials and go from there. Cool. Sounds good. Okay. So. Since we're talking about custom dispositions, let me just quickly show you. This is where you can update phone scripts. So lead types can be tied to phone scripts. So if you're working with a final expense lead type, it automatically will apply your final expense phone script, mortgage protection, like whatever, whatever lead type you're working can be tied to a specific phone script. Um, you can record your voice drops, your email templates, your SMS templates. Once you have that stuff set up, this is where you can add or edit what a disposition does. So let's say in the scheduled appointment, I'm going to 
click on key settings here and I want it to email this particular template. So these are the templates that you create. And, and most of, in fact, all of this stuff is already set up for you um, because the, you know, Cody's team has gone through and they've created templates that they're recommending. You can modify those if you want, you can create new ones, but all this is already pre-set up. So when you get your account, literally you could start selling right away, start calling and booking appointments. It does not take much time to, to set that up, but you know, I've, we've got it set up to send this email confirmation, an email reminder. And you can say, okay, I want this email reminder to go out four hours before the appointment. Maybe you want it to go three hours before the appointment. I want it to email myself, the agent. I want it to text the client a confirmation. I want to send out a reminder 30 minutes before. I want, <coughs> excuse me, I want, to, I want to, you know, drop a ringless voicemail 30 minutes before the appointment. Um, you know, I want to I want to do a live transfer. Let's say you have an appointment setter or a recruiter, and when you get somebody interested, I want them to be able to click a button and forward that live call to my cell phone. So you can do that. You can send you know zap ears. So all kinds of stuff that you can do at the click of a button. We're going to keep coming out with more um, more actions on those as well. One last thing, and then I'm going to bring on um, a couple of our guests, and that is the ability to add users. So this would be people that. They could be some of your newer agents. They could be an appointment setter or recruiter, someone that's going to make calls. And I, I wish I had added users. I should have thought about that before doing this demo. But if I had users here and they were on a call, I could actually see that they're logged in, they're on a call, and then I could listen into that call. And I could do what's called agent or it's called a call whispering. And so I can listen on the call and I could actually unmute myself and talk to the, to the agent without the client hearing what I'm saying. So I could say, hey, John, ask him this question or do this, say this. He could hear me, but the client can't hear me. How cool is that when you're coaching somebody to be able to do that? Or I could do what's called call bar. So if he wants to bring me in and actually introduce me as an expert. I could talk to the client or the agent with the call barge. So really cool. And that's a, that's a new feature for us. So we're super excited about that. All right. Um, that's all I'm going to go over for right now. And I'm going to bring on Cody, unless you want to say something before I bring on a couple of guests here to, to share their experience with the dialer. Well, just, just to reiterate, um, there's some amazing, that this is what, this is what, um, this, this is some of the things I'm so excited about, by the way, because, uh, like, I don't even know what, to, what, what, what do you call the feature where you, it literally shows you the duration to the next appointment. We call that the proximity calendar. So yeah, it just shows you exactly how far away it is to all your appointments. I mean, when you were in the field, Cody, can you imagine how awesome that would have been to know where to schedule people most efficiently? It's just unbelievable. It's, yeah, th th that's the piece of it. Like time's most valuable asset. I would book a one and a two and I'd be like, well, I don't know how far it is, but I'll figure it out when I get out there, right? Well, that's- oh, yeah. It's hurting me when I get out there. So, I mean, I can't tell you how many times I would go to an appointment and at the end of the day, I would have driven all over hour, hour and a half in the opposite direction. Then I'd come right back and I would have been five minutes from where I was this morning. I was like, man, if I had known how much time and, and gas have I wasted by not knowing that kind of stuff. Exactly. So, well, I'll, I'll have this jump to the guests, but yeah, this is, this is, this is unbelievable. Thank you for showing that. I mean, that was just a small taste of the ice cream that's in that bowl, by the way, yeah. it's, it's a freaking bucket full uh crazy impressive okay so thank you yeah i do see some questions here you can export leads from excel and, and you can export them from the dialer you can import them into the dialer so there's lots of different ways that you can handle leads um, you can use it as a crm we're, we're going to be improving the crm functionality um, so that's up to you you can always sync with another crm too so if you're if you like to use like zoho crm or another crm platform you can connect that with zapier to automatically update your CRM based on dispositions that you click or things like that. So a lot you can do. Um, all right. Uh, let's bring on Adam, uh, Adam Jr. You're out there. Great. Awesome. So this, I'm is, here. this is someone that's uh, he's one of our agents and he's been using the dialer. Uh, so Adam, how long have you been in the insurance industry? For a whopping seven months. Seven months. So you're not, <laughs> you're not, uh, 
super experienced yet. You got a little experience under your belt, but uh, just kind of still probably feel like you're figuring things out. Um, what are you on track to do in terms of sales this month in April? This month, I think my close of business today will probably be close to $68,000. $68,000. Thousand dollars in a month in personal production, and it's only your seventh month in the business. Right, right. <laughs> that is what, what did you do before insurance? Uh, I was a home builder. A home so, builder. So you didn't right. have a bunch of sales experience. You didn't have you you weren't used to dialing on the phones or anything like that. You you came from home building to insurance. And what is the dialer done? for you in terms of helping you kind of learn the industry and, 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 you know, get to the point where you're at right now? Well, I think it really boils down Matt and Cody to a couple things. When we came into the industry we, that we were looking for, my wife and I kind of sat down and we said, you know, you know, what kind of revenue can we expect from this industry or, or of ourselves in this industry? And because of COVID and some, what we felt were maybe limitations, we wanted the ability to work from home. And, uh, and so the dialer has been an integral part or tool. You know, I go back to my home building days, right? Like if I've got a tool belt on and I've got some uh, essential tools in that tool belt to help me get through the day or walk on a job site and not necessarily look like a knucklehead, right? I, I actually look, no, look like I know what I'm doing a little bit. Um, the dialer is just one of those tools that allows me um, to really um, kind of push all the momentum into our month um, as far as the revenue that we know will generate. Um, the dialers allowed us to, um, I mean, I like the term kind of like at will, create uh, five or more Zoom appointments a day. Um, it's almost spoiled me a little bit, on, if I'm honest, Matt, because I know that I can book five appointments at will for tomorrow if I sit down and have a few hour session tonight. I can book the next two days at five appointments a piece on Zoom calls. Um, and we love the flexibility and lifestyle of this, what this industry can give us. And the dialers allowed us to use that tool at will at strategic times of our week to fill those appointments and those appointments we know will have a direct result in the revenue we, we create. Well, so you mentioned Zoom. What, what percentage of your sales would you say are done uh, virtually? I think we've only spent one day in seven months outside of Zoom. So uh, about 99.9%. .9%. Wow. That's awesome. That is awesome. Well, we appreciate you uh, using the dialer and giving us your experience and anything else you want to add before I jump, jump over to Omar. You were talking about those features and I just love the fact that you can have that PDF of the actual lead you're working on the dialer face as oh, you're calling. You know what? I didn't even show that. That's a really good point. Let me just share what he's talking about here. You're talking just, about if you actually have the link to a PDF when you're uploading your leads, you can actually view the lead. So this is the handwritten lead that the agent had, or that the client had filled out. So while you're talking to them, you're actually able to look at the lead that they filled out while you're on the phone. Yeah, I was just going to say, you're able to disseminate from that lead all kinds of additional information. Does it look like the wife's handwriting or the husband's? Is it the husband's name and information? But you can tell from the handwriting that the wife filled it out. And so from that, you can approach the call in a different way. Um, and so it's just, it's been an absolutely valuable tool for us and the success we're having. And I thank uh, really you and Cody for allowing me to get on the call today. Cool. Thanks, Adam. Omar, you yeah. out there? Hey, Omar. Cool. Hey, Matt. This is Omar Diaz. Uh, he's been with us for several years now. Um, and every single year, he's pretty much been number one, number two in, in a company with, you know, 4,000 agents. Um, not just now, what's so impressive about you, Omar, isn't, isn't just the amount of business that you, that you submit. It's what you get issued. You've had the highest amount of issue and the highest issue rate of anyone in our entire company for the last few years. Every year you get the, what's, what we call the golden pen award. And uh, I think you get, it's like over 90% of what you submit issued. And that's, that's impressive. If you're submitting 10, $15,000 a month, what are you on track to, to submit this month, Omar? So I just finished, it's going to be about 73,000. 73,000 in personal production. Oh my goodness. And if you get a 90% issue rate on that, 
you guys can do the math. That's probably what, I, I don't know what contract level you're at, but I would say you're going to be making 60 grand this month from it's what you, <laughs> oh my good on personal production. Man, this industry is just awesome. Um, so talk to us about the dialer, because I know you were number one before you use the dialer. And that's why yeah. I wanted to bring you on here, because the dialer, a lot of people use tools as crutches. And you don't use the dialer as a crutch. You're going to be number one no matter what. But I remember, t tell us a little about what, what did you do before symmetry, or excuse me, before the insurance industry? And why did you, uh, why did you decide to get into insurance from what you were doing before? So... I was in the restaurant business and I was working 75, 80 hours a week. Okay. Um, it was horrible. You know, it seemed like every time I, did, I got an increase in pay, I got a decrease in time. And the ROI, which just wasn't there anymore. Like you got to see your kids play soccer through FaceTime and you got to just, you, you, you lived in this box, right? So when I came over here, I was really just, man, I just wanted some time back. That's all I want. I was willing to come over here. And I remember talking to my wife that, hey, I don't care if we make $50,000 a year, as long as we get some time back. Like we were willing to lose everything just to get some time back. And the reality is when I got here, they told me, hey, you're gonna have to book 18 appointments, stuff like that. And you know, you're gonna sit on 15 and you're gonna close half of them. And that's what I did. And, and, and you're right, you know, that's, I think the reason that I love the dollar so much because Man, I hated being on the phone for eight or nine hours on a Saturday to get my 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 week filled out for you know for the week, and you know just getting on the dialer and spending two hours, probably about an hour in the morning and an hour in the afternoon, and that was it. And booking those fifteen appointments for the week, and then you know come Monday, spend a little bit more time in the morning to book the rest of the week, and then if anybody didn't show up or stuff like that, you. Spend a little bit more time, you know, dialing, but it was so efficient because number two, man, I, I was in the restaurant business and the restaurant business, it is cost at any cost. Like you're going to make your budget. And just the amount of ink I went through starting off right here, having to buy paper, having to buy ink, because you had to print out your leads. It was very inefficient to be going back and forth. And the dialer just having everything in one place for me was a, was a, was a keeper, you know, it reduced our, our, our paper expenses. Our you know, ink is very expensive, like super expensive. So that for me was that. And then, you know, you think of how do you do 72, 73,000 in a week, you're constantly dialing. So if you have an appointment setter and you say, Hey, I'm on the field, I got this room booked off. It's, you know, I'm out in the field, she's making dials and all of a sudden I get a notification. Hey, the, 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 the little slot you had open that you were going to eat, <laughs> you're not. <laughs> you got an appointment here after this meeting. And it gets, sends you a notification like that. So I knew right away and said, from there, I went over there because I wanted, I only like working three days a week. Like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, days a week. You look at 73,000, it was done at, at an average of three days a week. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. That's what I was in the field. Because there's a Friday, you got to follow up on pending business. You got to go to that issue. So you got to cap get all your business and do it in three days. That's possible. And, but it wouldn't be possible without the dialer because I wouldn't have all the, you know, it's so simple. Then, you know, the, the, the week is set up and then you say, hey, well, I'm going to be in this area. You know, I was talking to you earlier. 10,000 of my business this month has been a little bit over like 11. 11.3, I believe I added up. I'm even starting to label them when it's a door knock. Just being able to schedule those door knocks because I'm going to be in this person. And you don't schedule 20 door knocks. You schedule two because I'm at this appointment, two because I'm at this appointment, one because I'm at this appointment. And all of a sudden, you get $11,000 in business from clients that, hey, well, you know what? My, my change my phone number. The other one, hey, I have my phone number programmed that if, if you're not on my contact list, it automatically blocks you. It's not even that it's spam. It's just, we don't answer if you're not on our contact list. Just being able to do that, it's so efficient for me. Okay, so just so for people to understand what you're doing, you you have a disposition that you set up for door knocking. You probably put like a 30 minute uh, window for that appointment and you'll, you'll book all your appointments out and then you go back through the ones you couldn't get a hold of and you'll use that proximity calendar to know 
when are you going to be near these people? And you start booking your door knocks when you're going to be near those people in your little windows of time. Is that, is that what you're saying? That is exactly what I'm saying. That's exactly the way I do it. Because and you, one- and You probably got it set up so that when you set that door knock, it's going to send them a text, maybe drop them a ringless voicemail, let them know, mm -hmm. hey, I'm going to stop by when I'm in your area tomorrow. Yep. And, and I do that every single week because I don't do 20 door knocks. I'll do five door knocks a week and only when I'm close to them. Because for me, you know, I, I talk a lot about the restaurant business, but you brought food in and the reality when that food came in, you wanted to get the most out of it, right? What the leads to me when I started this, the leads for me were my food. I didn't want waste. I wanted to get what's most out of it. And I wasn't willing to just let it sit right there. You know, I was going to make sure I got resolution. So the goal is, hey, how empty can I get the dialer in resolutions? Mm. How empty can I get? Like if you got 500 leads, there's a problem for me. If I got 50 leads, I'm getting closer. But, you know, a lot of say, hey, I got a whole bunch of leads. Well, the dialer will help you get less leads because you'll bring so much resolution into them. And that's how you really write fifty, forty thousand dollars a month. It's just efficiency. Man, that is awesome. Well, I, I appreciate you being on here, Omar. I know Friday's a heavy calling calling time for you, so we appreciate you taking time out of your schedule. Cody, um, I mean, you, you want to very much, Matt. Absolutely. Yeah, you want to um, go through how how people can get a hold of this dialer and start using it. Oh man, Omar, dude, who doesn't talk to me? Put say, say me in chat if you're like, man, I want to, I want to be, I want to be like Omar when I grow up. I, I, I work, <laughs> I work three days, three days a week, and I make sixty thousand dollars a month. Like man, um, but both both of these gentlemen, thank you guys very much for coming on. Um, that really means a lot. That was really cool for everybody to uh, not only hear your success with the dialer, but just also to hear like your personal success in general. You know. Um, like that's what it's all about. So that's so cool, man. Thank you for hooking it up and making uh, it possible, Matt, for some real powerhouse and real impressive production oriented individuals to come up and hang with us. Yeah. 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 So I'm going to have, I'm going to have Cassidy put the link in chat right now. Um, we are doing, I believe it, it's a, it's a, it's a 14 day free trial too, right? Yes. Um, actually the link that she put in there is for the, uh, the onboarding which is great. We want everyone to go through that. It's a 90 minute free onboarding. It'll walk you through how to get everything set up, how to use it in more detail. Yes. Um, if you go to cadialer.com. I'm going to get the, I'm going to get the right here. Uh, you can actually sign up for it. And we try to make this as affordable as possible. It's cheaper than any, pretty much anything out there that we could find. Um, and you get so much more for it. Um, but you're going to make so much more from increased, you know, increased production, increased efficiency, time savings from gas, like, like Omar said, from ink and print, you know, paper, all that stuff. So we try to make it a no brainer. But in addition to that, you get your first 14 days for free, um, try it out and then go to that link that Cassidy put in there, which is uh, CA dialer forward slash onboarding. And you can sign up for the group training uh, which is next Tuesday at two and they'll, she'll walk you through exactly how to set up everything. That's awesome. So. I love that. Yeah, that's good. I, you, you, that's also a cool piece too. Not only to hit the link and, and try for the free trial, make sure you guys do that. Okay. Uh, right away. Um, but also the, the onboarding is one of the coolest pieces because I've bought a lot of software over the years. I've never had someone like a, a way for me to jump on a training and actually walk me through setting it up and being on it. Um, so yeah. that's, that's, that's really cool. It's, it's going to be every week, by the way, this next one's Tuesday. The following one will be the, the, the next Thursday. So we'll alternate between Tuesdays and Thursdays each week. Um, and that'll be for, for individuals that are, that are using the dialer and want to be better at using it and really uh, learning how to customize it. And like these guys have, right. Um, like, like Omar. Yeah. Yeah. Which is huge, man. I love that. Okay. Um, well, I, I know for me, I have seen enough to sign up for the dialer if I'm you guys. Okay. Um, Matt, anything else you want to add, sir? Appreciate you showing us around. No, I just appreciate you, Cody, and everything that you do and, uh, you know, pouring into 
to agents and it's just it's it's awesome what you do so i'm happy to be partnered up with you and, you. and yeah thank you very much i love it okay give everybody a hand for matt all right thank you very much for being on preaching to showing us around that is a bad man right there that dude is he's, he's a bad dude okay thank you thank you thank you hey if you enjoyed this i got another one you're gonna love it's right there click on it see you in there I heard Gary one time saying, you know, the day that you realize that everything is your fault, your life will change. Mm. And I was like, oh, why he means like that? And then I'm I- am getting chills because that's so good. Yeah. It's so good. And then I realized- Pay attention to this, guys. I'm telling you, this is gold.